Welcome to Indiscriminate Nature. In today's video, we are going to be doing a taste test on a Universal Yums. It's a little uh, snack crate that you could order online. They'll send uh, a box every month and you get to test different snacks around the world. And in today's video, we have my nieces, my niece and my nephew. <laughs> we have Cassidy and Steven helping us out. And then my lovely wife, Tiff, is helping out with the camera in the background. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. So the... Ooh. All right. The box. Um, we're not too sure exactly where it's from. You kind of get little hints on the outside with the sticker. Um, this one says, uh, the land of the milk and honey. So, and then there's a little picture of a camel in the back. So that's probably from back in the day. A camel. A hey, camel. Dude. I didn't hear you. What like a camel. What you I'm said. A little camel. I didn't hear what you said. Oh. Three. <laughs> All right. Don't try that at home. This is covered. It has that a sleeve on, me. so it's all safe. That scared me. <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> you don't trust me? No. Not when you open it like that. Oh, that's cool. Alright, we'll put that aside. Alright. <gasps> oh my god. So we're going to bask in the gloriness for a second. Um, in the box, we do get a little uh, picture of the area that we're going to be observing. Israel. Um, we get a little Welcome to Israel book. Um, kind of gives us a little disclaimer of everything that we're going to be trying out. <laughs> I forgot to turn off my phone. <laughs> awesome. All right, we're going to lay these out real quick and uh, get some pictures for you guys. So when we're doing the video, you guys can see them up close and we don't have to worry about the camera trying to focus on them while we're doing the video. Um, and then the way everything's going to work is we're going to try them out. And we're going to rate them whether we eat them or if we don't like them. Yeah. Or like or I'm like dislike. Nervous. Or... I'm like nervous we, like... we like them or we don't like them. I'm nervous yeah. because of like, I don't like something that's going in my mouth. And I don't like the feeling of that because then it like hits my tongue and the tongue just like, <laughs> it, it has like that feeling where you don't like really like something and you just like want to spit it out so bad. <laughs> well, we will have a spit can for that. These guys ready? Yes. All right, we'll get right to it. All right, so we have everything lined up. Um, in the box, you get a little uh, pamphlet. I was saying before, you get a little pamphlet that kind of gives you a description of each and every one um, and the, the cultural aspect of it um, and what it means to them. Um, this is all from Israel, uh, Snacks from Israel. We don't um, speak, the native language there is Hebrew. Uh, we don't speak Hebrew or m understand Hebrew too much. So my wife's going to be reading these off and the descriptions of them. And she's going to try her best to pronounce the names as accurately as possible. So please don't get upset if uh, <laughs> she pronounces something wrong. Um, so let's see, which one are we going to start with, guys? Mm -hmm. we got to agree on one um, to start with. You the too. candy bar? Yeah, yeah me too. Alright. So we're going to try good. out this... Um, it looks like a chocolate bar. It looks like a chocolate bar. But yeah. If it is or not, because... Again, some chocolates are different. Yep, yep, exactly. Some chocolates are different. And we never know what's inside of them. Also, to kind of keep it a little fair, um, we're going to be tasting this before she goes and reads the description of them. Just so they don't get freaked out about some of the ingredients and, you know, kind of trick them up. Hey! <laughs> right. If you hear something you don't like, you're not going to eat it. I know you. Yeah. 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 I'm, I'm just it's eating true. one little piece. I'm not eating the whole thing. A little block? Yeah. There you go. I need a little block. A little block. So it comes... A cow. Oh, ooh! There's a cow on it. Yeah, there's, um... It smells like normal chocolate. Oh, what if it has a like cow meat inside? <laughs> Ew. I don't think there's cow meat inside. Yeah, but it shows like a moose or a cow on the front. Oh, yeah, definitely. I think it has the their logo of a cow on it. Yeah. It's pretty cool. It smells 
Um, we'll, I'll get a picture of it uh, for you guys so you can see it up close and what we're seeing. Um, all right, ready? Yeah. One, two, Looks pretty good. Mm-hmm. You st you seem so nervous about it. <laughs> Why? Because I am. <laughs> as, like some as, you, as some of you might know, my nephew isn't exactly keen on trying new things. I am. It has like pop rocks in it. Yeah. <laughs> mm hmm Yo, that is so cool. It is. Ain't it? Alright, feel, feel it. Yeah, you feel it? I get that. I feel it. I still have the job. Cass, would you eat it again? Yes. Chubs? Yes. Wait, listen. <laughs> I don't Nathan, think we can You can wash it. Sometimes. Nathan. I would definitely eat these. This is like chocolate, pop rocks, crunch, all in a mix. Oh. It's so good. Mm -hmm. I get it. Uh, Alright. I can't try anything. <laughs> What's the description of it? Strauss popping chocolate. Chocolate with pop rocks? Whoa. You've likely never tried a chocolate bar like this before. We're trying it again? A snack again, experience man. unlike any other. <laughs> this chocolate is incredibly popular in Israel and you'll soon taste why. Mm. I found the pop rocks mm. in my mouth. You guess what's going Now, oh, now, no. don't spoil your dinner. Again, <laughs> me. Mm -hmm. Uh-uh. <laughs> Alright. So we're off on a really good start. Mm -hmm. um, Let's go in order. How about that? We should go in order. I'm just saying. Yeah. Alright, we'll go in order then. So I'll move all this forward. There we go. I'm so, not even done. This looks like peanuts. Peanuts. There's a kangaroo on it. There we go. The kangaroo. Wait, does a kangaroo have a pocket? Yeah, there's a little pocket right there. Mm -hmm. oh, We're good. It's a real kangaroo. It has a pocket. Well, it, it seems like a real kangaroo. All right, hold out your hand. Um, since these are small, I'm gonna give you two each. <laughs> that was pop talk. Mmm. I smelt it. Oh, it don't smell good. No, it doesn't smell spicy. bad. That doesn't smell good either. Well, you gotta eat it. Ready? Three. Three, two, one. Uh-uh. No? Uh-uh. <laughs> you good or do you need the spit bucket? You good? Mm -hmm. Alright. There you go. Alright, so what did we just eat? Well, first of all, Cass, would you eat it again? Yes, oh, definitely. I'm getting out of order. Steven? No. Nathan? Uh, yeah, i would eat it again. It's not bad. No. I don't like it. No? Alright. Falafel Shashi. Throughout history, Israel has been mired in conflict. That conflict has spread to all aspects of the country and even applies to this food. Falafel, fried fritters made from chickpeas or fava beans mixed with herbs, spices, and onions, is indisputably ancient dish. At first when I smelled it, I, I just thought it would be like spicy because like, there was like <clears throat> a hint of like a spiciness. So you didn't even know there was onions in it? No. Well, then. Not until you said it. <laughs> well, that's why she's saying it afterwards. It's a Twinkie with sprinkles. Twinkie with sprinkles. All right. All right. This now. Yeah, we're going in order. Yeah, I'm saying like. <laughs> you said he didn't like onions. I didn't. All right. Yeah, he didn't. All right. Natalie. You ready? No. Yes. I want. To... All right. Oh, no. Oh. Wait, what is that? Oh, what that's that cute. Onion. <laughs> I was trying to hide it. You don't like onions. I'm trying to hide it from you. No. All right, don't smell it. Um. Don't smell it. All right, so we were having a little bit of technical difficulties. Um, you guys ready? Yep. Three, two, one, go. It tastes like a funion. <laughs> yeah. I'm funny. 
you never had the Funyuns? No. Oh. I never I had like them. Like those onion rings, but then said I like chips. No. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. I oh love no, wait. Yeah. See, the thing I is, I can't, them. I can't put my leg straight, so like I'm not gonna have to turn my legs straight because there you go. The chair, I mean, the table just blocks it. Okay, that's good. Yep. Yep. All right. Cassie, would you eat again? Yep. Even? No. Nathan? Yeah, I'll eat them again. <laughs> All right. That is Onion Bisley. Open this package and look carefully at what you see. Do the tubes look like anything familiar? Possibly something you eat with sauce? No. I mean, All of the varieties of Bisley are made to look like different types of pasta, hearkening back to the company's humble beginnings. What an awesome story. Kind of looks like yeah. a little ziti noodle. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> What's a ziti noodle? Pretty interesting. A ziti noodle? I've never smelt it though. Mm. Wait, what's not? What's a ziti noodle? Ziti noodle? Yeah. Yeah. It is, it's a tube. Oh. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's the pasta that looks like a tube. You have it uh, in baked ziti? Okay. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, pr I'm pretty sure you do. I think it's just. Save the Twinkie for last. You're having a brain fart. Which one's, uh, that's, I don't think that's a Twinkie. <laughs> I call it a Twinkie because it looks like one. Yeah. It, it, oh, what is that? It kind of looks like a Twinkie. Um, no. Ever? Does it like those? Everything flavored snacks. Oh, I have. So, Chick Chack, that's what it says on the bag, and it says everything flavored snacks. Oh, what do they mean by everything? We're about to find out. Ooh, what if they put yeah. like just a bunch of stuff together and just... And then boom, they created that. <laughs> Alright. Ooh. Thank you. My stomach just grow. <laughs> <laughs> you got a little one. We all got little ones. Yeah, we got... It's Actually, I think Cass's is the biggest... You want a smaller piece? Are you good? I'm good. I All got right. the littlest one. Look how big it is. It's big. <laughs> All right. Ready? Three, yeah. two, one, go. Uh uh. Cass, would you eat it again? Yeah? I mean... Shabby, would you eat it again? Watch it. Steven, would you eat it again? No. That's a no. No, I'm not, no. That tastes okay. disgusting. No, the only thing that I didn't like about it is when you like cut it in your mouth and your mouth was closed, you hear like the air just like didn't taste like really good. Or, like when it's in your mouth. Like, I feel like I, tip, I taste that taste before. It, it never mind. It let, doesn't let taste go good. <laughs> I mean, I would eat it, but it didn't have like no flavor. But the only let's thing just go. Hold on. on this one. Oh, well, we gotta get a description eat. of it. What was? What did we just eat? Everything chick check. The word everything might be in the name of the snack, but it's a little deceptive. Men, many Israel Jews can't eat everything, and that's because they keep kosher. There's no meat, dairy, or bugs, thankfully, in these crunchy wheat bites, but they do have everything else you can want in a snack, including salt, turmeric, paprika, and a handful of fresh spices. You can now see that the spirals of goodness are actually named quite appropriately. Ooh. All right. Ooh. All right. Why would they put bugs in the snack? You want me to put it's them the only point I'm trying to figure out. You ever see those dried out crickets? I want another one of them. Oh, no. oh, that's disgusting. We're going at the end. We'll retry every single snack at the end. No, no, no. That's right. what we should do. We could snack on everything at the end. Yes. Whatever you like. The I chocolate. I had so far, that's chocolate. what I like. The chocolate's my favorite. The chocolate was really good. Man. But I'm hoping for the top rocks. That's so good. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I like how they mix it. It was definitely different. I liked it a lot. I did too. Ready? Know. It's definitely different than other types of chocolate. Oh. Actually, you got... 
I want a small one. One big piece that had like three conjoined together. Yeah, Here. let's probably take one of those off. Nathan yeah, will take. I'll, I'll take back. Darn, I wanted you to take take that one. You want me to take that yeah. one? Yeah. Challenge for you. Oh. <laughs> so if it's bad, I just it have a lot of it. It actually smells very good. Yeah, it oh, does. Oh, yeah, it actually smells like peanut butter. Mm hmm. All right. Ready? Oh, no. All right, there. <laughs> can't, can't itch. No. Ready? Yep. Okay, you ready? Mm-hmm. Three, two, one. Mm-hmm. You're copying me. Yeah, <laughs> it's actually really good. <laughs> I like how, like, when I bite it into it, I feel like some, like, some peanut butter, like, mm -hmm. in the side. Can I yes. Get the inside? Would you eat it again? Yes. Yes. Nathan? Yeah. Definitely. What did we just have? Crumbly nougat bites. Peanut butter coated cereal bites with hazelnut cream. You may not believe it, but you're holding in your hands a modern scientific discovery. Yes, this snack has saved lives. For years, scientists noticed an interesting trend in Israel. There was a shockingly low number of children with peanut allergies, far lower than any other modern nation. Whoa. That's actually really good. So we ate something that could possibly save people's lives. Am I right? Or is that wrong, Red? Yeah, right. That'd be accurate to say. Which one are we doing next? Twinkies um, for last. Twinkies for last. All right, then we'll leave them. Twinkies All right, we'll go last. with the uh, little fun-sized... But no, they're not. Uh, they're green. Mondage. They're mini. That stands for mini. I think. I I was holding it upside down. Oh. She's I, right. That stands for <laughs> it does? She's right. You're... <laughs> Mine's <laughs> in the Puerto Rican. Hmm? I don't know. I knew it meant mini. There you go. Because I don't want to say anything that's like small. Are we just seeing that one? Uh, we'll, we'll just try to split one up so we don't have to open up two. Oh! Um, Alright, um, I'm going to actually need a smaller knife if I can get that real Bro, quick. Bro, that huge. Yeah, but... How does it feel? It, it's... Does it feel uh, like cookie dough? No, it's not like cookie dough. I, I'll take the piece that I was poking at. Wow! Thank you. That was so, so safe. Alright, so I'll take this end piece that I was poking. There you go. Ready? Three, two, one. You like it? It's oh. weird. Mm. It's a weird texture. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Very weird. It's velvet. It, it, it's. I don't even know how to explain it, really. Can I scoop this out? Yeah, a little bit. You okay? Oh, I didn't like. The thing is, it, it just disgusted me because, like, the peanut butter and something else mixed together. I didn't like. Oh. Yeah, it was a. It tastes like bean boozled. Bean boozled, really? Yeah, yeah. That's oh, what that reminds me. me. That reminds me of what I did in class. Oh yeah. I don't know. But it um, it was some weird texture though. It was like. Uh oh, I want to It wasn't that. solid. <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't like, like fully liquid, but like it felt like it was kind of like cum liquid in my mouth. I like. Yeah. Well, it has, but there's two different ones. No, no, it was uh, this one. I know, but there's two different ones of these. So which one do you call the Twinkie? The biggest one. Then we'll start. Then we'll do this one next. Uh, yeah. Um, but why don't we figure out what we ate first? Yeah. Would you eat it again? No. Steven? No. Uh-oh. Mm -hmm. I saw the really aftertaste in my mouth. <laughs> it, it was terrible. Ready? Yep. Yes. Mini pistachio halva, sesame candy with pistachios. Mmm, a sweet bet. That's a thousand years old. Sounds appetizing, right? Well, the good news is that the halva is in your, 
and your hands is as fresh as it can be. And it's just the recipe that's old, very old. In fact, it goes back way, way back to the 1100s. 1100s? Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow, that is quite some time ago. You bet. All right, so, all right, we're no, going to save no. this one for last, right? Not yeah. Twinkie. This one's for last, yeah. and then we're doing this one. The we're going to do the, the smaller one. Powdered. Is that powdered sugar? I, I think flour? it is either powdered sugar or, or maybe of... some flour to yeah. keep it from sticking. I'm going to assume that it's gummy, like has a gummy texture without just eating it. I I'm trying not to Ugh. touch it too much. That is definitely a gummy. Yeah. I haven't had gummies in a long time. Ooh, 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 sticking. Yeah, that's definitely why there's powder sugar. That's powder sugar, then. Half yeah, that's what I did get her. <gasps> Mason, <laughs> I'm sorry, I made a mess. Yeah, I want this one. You want that one? Yeah. Alright, you want the one in the bag? Yes. Did you eat it already? No, oh, it's, in it's in my hand. Oh. I, I thought smell, she I like the already. whiff of the powder came to my nose and I smelled it. I was like, ooh. Like Alright. You ready? It's sticking yeah. to me. Alright. That's a gummy. Three, two, yeah. one. one, go. <laughs> Jeremy's face. I mean, Steven's face. Give me in the bag. Mm -mm. That was really weird. That was really, really weird. It's fruity and nutty, gummy and chewy and crunchy. That looks it feels crunchy. like. It yeah, was. No, it wasn't. Uh, then it must have been my piece. What? Where's your? Where's I got your... a bit of crunching. Yeah, I got a bit of crunching too. I didn't either. All um... right. You ready? Mhm. Mm Would you eat it again? No. See you. No. Nathan. Um, yeah, actually. Alright. Pomegranate Turkish Delight. Pomegranate candy with almonds. Eating this tasty treat is nice, but do you know what would be even better if eating this tasty treat made you and everyone who ate it a nicer person? Well, maybe it will. In, Jerusalem, in Judaism, pomegranates have long been considered a symbol of moral and spiritual righteousness. Awesome. That's really cool. I, I really like this kind of um, product that we have. Because it does give you a little bit of... You okay? Yeah. I just see your head drop. Yeah, I went like this on my fingers. <laughs> but it gives you a little bit of a history behind the the um, the food or the snacks that you try. It tastes like a, a that grape. That's for the big tool. Mixed in like, like a blueberry. Which I don't like blueberries. Mm. Yeah, it, it's, it's definitely... It's bad. I'm not going to miss it. It's um, not a Twinkie. I call it a Twinkie. It looks like one of those Twinkies. Yeah, like a, a mini-sized okay. Twinkie. Yeah, totally. I mean, I can see what you're talking about with the, like, the shape and everything of a Twinkie. But it's not a Twinkie. You can't I know it's not a Twinkie. Yeah, I call it a Twinkie, though. <laughs> calling it a Twinkie. What? I personally can't wait to see your reaction for this one. Does it have coconut? Why am I going to tell you? Why are you asking oh, questions? Oh, yeah. Wait, so you know he's not going to like it. I'm not going to tell you what's in it. <sighs> Nathan. <laughs> oh. I'm going to squirm if it has coconut in it and kind of looks like it does have coconut flakes Well, on you it. see this? This is why we have a bag. Uh -huh. I'm going to spit this thing out right away, but. All right. Ready? Oh, it's like solid. It, it's a little bit hard. A little bit. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> It's not like hard, hard. It's just it, there's like an outer shell. Oh, scared y'all. All right. I mean, I cut one size too big, so I guess I'll take the bigger piece. And then I'll take this piece because I'm that extra. <laughs> <laughs> I dare you to eat that entire piece. I never pass up on a dare. I'm gonna eat the bigger <gasps> piece. <gasps> Uh, I'm, I'm concerned. I'm very concerned no. because 
<laughs> Ready? Three, two, one, go. That's coconut. <laughs> I smelled it too. I didn't want to smell it. I'll be good for now. Are you sure about it? Yep, yeah, I'll be good for now. Mm-hmm. Got a muscle through it. <laughs> like be a man. <laughs> Here he is, boy. Oh my god. Anyway, uh, not, no, not a fan. Mm -mm. Not, uh, not, not a fan. Not mm -hmm. a fan. You would not eat that again, Ken? Uh-uh. Stubby? No. No. Yeah, I can tell by that face. You need a drink? I'll grab a drink. The... <laughs> <laughs> I knew there was coconut. I'm surprised I'm not. <coughs> Ready? Only one that didn't spit it out. <laughs> yeah, sure. Whoa. Marone coconut rose, coconut bar rolled in coconut flakes. You've heard of Jesus of Nazareth. Well, now meet the coconut rolls of Nazareth. These traditional Israel rolls are made in the same city that Jesus is believed to have lived. While the city has changed quite a bit since Jesus' time, it remained an important place for both Christians and Muslims. After one bite of this brightly colored sweet, you can basically say you've been a tourist in Nazareth. All right. She's going to go off that one sentence after a bite of it. What? I'm surprised that I wasn't the one <laughs> to spit it out the most times. I didn't spit it out any time. Yeah, high five. I did. I, and I did like twice. And mostly I wanted to, but I did. That's good. Because you to take it like a chance. Yep, yep. Yeah. So... <clears throat> I did not like the little bit of a tour. <coughs> I liked the last bit. Excuse me. The I last bit of it, too. I did not like it at all. I hate coconut. That's the one thing I don't think I could ever eat. Well, now you just did. So. <laughs> Basically, there is five of them that Cassie would still eat. Yep. There is two of them that Stephen will eat. You're picky. And then there's five of them that you will eat. Five of them that I would eat. Mm -hmm. Out of nine. Eight. 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 So we I got like two out of eight. Wait, I don't so that, one, that one and that one. For me. All right. Yep. Yeah. Man, they, they were definitely interesting. Definitely something different. All right, that would be it for today's video. If you have any um, ideas for future videos, sorry, I still can't talk. If you have any ideas for future videos, leave them in the comment section down below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Hey. There you go, thumbs <laughs> up. <laughs> and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Peace.